Hi, I'm Josh Huberman, and today we're going to build a DIY boot rack using horseshoes. And uh, just got some horseshoes from the local hardware store. Um, I'm going to take you through setting it up, uh, laying it out, tacking it together, uh, and then we'll weld it out. And then hopefully this will be a quick, easy project that if you've got a brand new welder at home that you can use. So let's get started. First, I'm going to take these first six horseshoes, I'm going to lay them in a line, and this is going to be kind of where the boots rest into. Uh, main thing is just kind of keeping them nice, straight, and flat, so if you have a nice flat work surface and a straight edge that you can place these on, uh, that would be the best. And all I'm doing is I'm using the edge of the table right here as my guide and then just giving it a good eyeball. So now that I've got that, they're setting nice and flat together. I'm going to come in and just kind of tack, just put a nice simple tack on them. Not going to fully weld it out yet. Um, just something to hold it in place so I can still move it around. Um, and when it's ready, I'm going to probably do some welding on the underside and around the edges, and that's going to be my majority of the weld that's going to hold it together. If you really want it, you can clamp it down, but just since I'm doing a little tack, I'm just going to hold it with my fingers and then put a tack right in the middle. Eyes. Same thing, just going to put a nice little tack just to kind of hold them in place. Go ahead and do it one more time. Now that we got those tacked together, um, I'm going to go ahead and kind of just add a little bit more weld on these just so they're fully firm. Um, once I do that, then we'll go ahead and move this up top, tack these to the two sides, uh, and then we'll cut our little rest bar that will go in front of that and then the boot rack will be done. cleaned up. Uh, we're just going to kind of kind of build this in reverse. So I'm going to set this down on the table and then 
pull this and uh, throw a square on it real quick. Just to hold it at 90. Just going to put a couple small tacks. I'm going to do the same thing on that side. And then we'll cut the little support bar that goes in the front. Okay. And if you just so happen to have a magnet 90, you can use that as well to help you out and also kind of hold it in position while you're getting ready to tack it together. Now, if you don't have to have a magnet or anything like that, when you're fabricating, you can always just kind of rely on your eyeballs. Most of the time, it's, you're going to be correct. If, if it looks like it's a 90 degree angle, it's probably a 90 degree angle. So you can feel free and just kind of eyeball it as well. Now that's tacked up. Got it here, sitting on the table. I am going to take and cut a piece of bar that will go across here so your boots can rest on them. So what we'll do is we'll take measurement there. Uh, Where that measurement is, I'm going to cut it on this bar and we'll weld it in place. And at this point too, we probably bring in our, uh, some test boots uh, just to make sure that where we put this bar, uh, you know, we're going to catch our heels on those. So. Give it your final cleanup with the grinder. And there you have it. Nice little boot rack. Quick little easy project that you can do at home. Uh, feel free and you can do this project however you want. You know, it can be meant to hold 
three pairs, it can hold two pairs, six pairs, whatever. Make it your own. This is just an idea for you to take with and run with and get you a little bit of practice building some, using your machine, getting used to your machine. Uh, so yes, if you ever make one of these and you see the video, definitely drop a picture in the comments so we can see what you made for your creation. Um, once you have it, this is also raw steel, so you can uh, leave it as is. You can paint it. Uh, you can let it rust. Get that natural patina on it. Do whatever kind of finish you want and make this project something that you're going to be proud that you can show off at home.